I know. I have like three more minutes of work left. No? He's definitely a chatty Kathy with me a lot of the time. Are you ready to go home? Yeah? Was it a really, really, really long day at work? Yeah? When my fosters are small and don't need to be bottle fed, they generally come to work with me. Hello. Welcome to the world. It was very touch and go for the first couple of days with her being so small. She was very fragile and pretty sick. You're very naked leggies. She was definitely one of the smallest premature kittens that I've ever seen. She was actually smaller than my computer mouse at work. She just, from the very start, was a super loving kitten. She started purring, I think, at like four days old, which you don't see a whole lot of. It was very sweet. That, to me, as a foster parent, is just like, okay, I'm doing something good. She's happy, she okay. feels comfortable, she feels loved with me. Yeah? Yeah? Is that whole time? Okay. What are you doing? It took us nine weeks to get to a pound. Hi. She definitely talked back the most at the office. I think she got tired of hearing my voice all day and wanted to make her own opinion heard. I mean, I thought the report was pretty good, personally. Okay, I need like two or three more minutes. That's all. Please? I think she was trying to tell me that I had enough Zoom calls for the day and it was time I to go home. my email, okay? No? It was definitely very fulfilling to see her coming out of her shell and gaining weight. Hi. Is that gonna teach you to not climb up things? It made me feel really good to finally see her thriving. <laughs> Hi. Fostering her was definitely a labor of love and just a reminder that sometimes things need to just cook a little more and develop a little longer, but the end result is definitely worth it. Look at that booty. I would love to see her being spoiled in her next adoptive home and for the family that just can help grow that already amazing personality of hers.